Chief Standing Bear was once not even recognized as a person by the U.S. government. Now, 144 years later, his face is on the newest stamp. KETV News Watch 7, Zander Ozaki has the unveiling to honor the Ponca tribe's hero. U.S. Postal Service, Ponca and Nebraska leaders unveiled the Chief Standing Bear stamp on Centennial Mall in Lincoln, next to the Ponca Chief statue. This story of an indigenous rights hero is truly and deservedly an American story. And with this stamp, his legacy is further etched into our nation's consciousness. His story of love and bravery, defying the weather and U.S. government. In 1879, he and 29 other Ponca walked 500 miles in the winter to honor his son's dying wish to be buried in his homeland along the Niobrara River in Nebraska. Then he fought his arrest in court, leading to the landmark decision recognizing American Indians as persons. I am a man, said Chief Standing Bear, in his court hearing nearly 145 years ago. Such a simple statement yet so profound in its importance. And relevant today, according to Chief Standing Bear's direct descendant, Steve Larravee, Jr. So today, we must work together. What Standing Bear stood for was unity, compassion, and uh, strength. So if we can continue to make the, that braid of life, then we're going to be better as a people, as a nation. A forever message, now on a forever stamp. In Lincoln, Andrew Ozaki, KETV, News Watch 7.